four seeds will contest the final tomorrow. Yul and Pedersen of Denmark in their second consecutive final here. So after the women's doubles, we turn our attention to the mixed doubles. And Matthias Christiansen and Christina Pedersen are up against Zheng Shi Wei and Wang Yaxiong. Zheng Shi Wei and Wang Yaxiong trying to reach their sixth final in their sixth tournament together. There you can see there was three Chinese pairs at quarterfinal, two in semi-finals, but who will play against Watanabe and Higashino tomorrow. This is the Yonex All England Open Badminton Championships 2018 and the mixed doubles semi final. Let's welcome the players. First up, the number six seeds from Denmark, Matthias Christiansen and Christina Pedersen. Matthias Christiansen and Christina Pedersen for Christina Pedersen. Well, she's been in an All England Mixed Doubles final two years ago. Last year, she was in the Women's Doubles final. We know she's in the Women's Doubles final tomorrow. Can she make it two finals in this particular tournament on one day? That would be a remarkable achievement. And let's hear it for their opponents. The number five seeds from China, Zhang Siwei and Huang Yaojiao. Zhang Siwei and Wang Yaxiong of China. This is only their sixth ever tournament in this partnership. The previous five, they have always reached the final and they've won four titles from those five previous finals. Huang Yaxiong, she is the defending champion because a year ago she won the title with Liu Kai beating Chang Peng Sun and Go Liu Ying of Malaysia in the final. Well, this is the third meeting between these two pairs. The previous two, incidentally, were both in finals. The last time they met was in the final of the Hong Kong Open. 21-15, 21-13 in just 35 minutes for the Chinese pair. And in, incidentally, the previous time they met to that was the previous week to the Hong Kong Open. The final of the China opening, it was a very similar scoreline, 21-15, 21-11, again in just 35 minutes. Well, this man, Cheng Shi Wei, really has had a remarkable run of late. But his partner, Wang Yaxiong, making her fourth consecutive appearance here. And as I was saying, she is the defending champion. She turned 24 last month, born in Kuzhou in the southwest of Xijian province in East China. And she has been as high as two in the world with the partner with whom she won the title a year ago. Cheng Shi Wei turned 21 last month from Wenzhou, also in Xijian province. He is currently the world number one with Chen Xing Cheng. Now, they had a very, very tough battle yesterday against the number two seeds, Wang Ilu and Wang Dongping. 54 minutes for that victory, having won their second round match. Yes, that's correct. 20 minutes with the loss of only 10 points. Now, they really have had the most incredible start to their partnership. So, Christina Pedersen. 31 years of age, born in Aalborg in North Jutland. And as I was saying, she's already through to the women's doubles final for a second consecutive year. So she's hoping to reach a fourth final within three years if she and partner Matthias Christiansen were to win today. He turned 24 last month from Bornholm, the island of Bornholm. 
and they have actually gone down one place in the world ranking from their career high went down on Thursday to 16 having had one week at number 15 in the world so they had a big battle in their first two matches against Lamsfuss and Hertrick of Germany coming from a game down and then in the second round against uh, Dichapon Puanar Varanukro and Sapsuri Tedratanachai dropped the second game there. That was their longest match so far, an hour and 20 minutes. And then in the quarterfinal beat the 2016 winners, the number four seeds, Travine Jordan and Debbie Susanto. So our umpire, Stefan Vernet of France, Cornelia Schroeder of Germany is the service judge. China. <laughs> Wang Yashan to serve to Matthias Christiansen. Lovo. Wait. So Wang Yashan and Cheng Shiwei nearest to us getting this semi final underway. Ow! Both these pairs very new in their Wang combinations. Love. The Danes only formed their partnership at the Denmark Open last October. Hey! The Chinese pair only formed their partnership at the Macau Grand Prix One. Gold last oh. November. Won the Macau event, then one in China, then one in Hong Kong the following week. Three titles in three weeks. What a start to a partnership. Then at the beginning of this year, they lost in the final of the Malaysian oh. Masters. And then Service a week over. later, one in the Indonesian Masters. Two. But one. Morton, when I was saying that Sheng Shiwei has had a remarkable run, he has been in the final of the last 11 yeah. tournaments that yeah. he's played. Yeah. Five with his current partner, Wang yeah. Yaxiong, and six previously to that with Chen Xing Chen. Yes. I mean, he's a dominant force in mixed doubles, isn't he? He is. He just surged on the scene and... Uh, we, we never saw so what happened. He just searched all the way to world number one in a very short time. That was with Chen Xing Cheng. It was, yeah. and yeah. Uh, he is oh. still number one in the world with, with her, yeah. despite the fact that they're not playing. Yeah. It's amazing. But hopefully, from a, a Danish perspective, it's going to be... A tighter, closer match than the two previous Three, ones, two. where they they lost in two games um, in uh, in November last year. So um, let's see how it goes. I think that the Danish pair has improved a lot, so perhaps uh, we're in for a treat here. Service over. Well. Three. Oh. If they do manage to win, then Christina Pedersen is in two finals tomorrow. The last player to be in two finals was five years ago, Zhao Yun Lei. Yeah. And she, in fact, lost both finals. Did she? That year, 2013. That was unusual for her. Yeah. Four, she has been winning three. a lot. A little bit of luck there. Oh, Christina Pedersen. And here we 
we saw what I was trying to say in the women's Five, doubles later. Look three. at that attacking shot and straight away in counter-attacking it. Yeah. Brilliant. My goodness, he was quick onto that mid-court push, wasn't he? He was. Six. He is hyped up. Three. Got it back, Matthias. Oh, it's all very fast and furious, isn't it? it is. Goodness. Crikey. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, out. Service over. Well, Morton, you and I had the pleasure of watching Seven, Christiansen and Pedersen four. play their first round match against Lemfus and Hertrick. Yes. And we didn't think that Christina Pedersen was playing at her best. But it's a yes. sign of a champion to be able to win or find a way to win when you're not at your best. And I think she's been getting better and better as the tournament has progressed. Yes, I, I totally agree with you, and I think it's got a lot to do with her, her service situation. She's trying to adapt to the new, to the new rule and the service services, and I think you know settling in on all that because she's so good on that third shot. Yeah, five and that's seven. I think taking her a little bit of time to settle in on it. He may have missed on that return, but the fact that he's wanting to pounce on the low serve, it's the sort of thing you were talking about in the women's doubles, that if you go for it, even if you miss it early on, then your opponents are wary of playing back there. Uh, you're sending a strong message, and I think Matthias was doing that. Of course, do not miss it again, but he, he is sending a good message. Yeah. Seven, oh. Back level, seven all. <laughs> yeah, good call from Matthias. Yeah, he's broken seven the strings over. of his racket. Eight. Seven. Yeah, Matthias is really pumped up. It's good, but it's also he's got to be a little bit careful that he's not going over the top and he's starting to make a lot of mistakes and he, he's so eager to do all the right things. So he's got to have a cool head when he's playing now. Yeah. Because I think if, if he's too hyped up, he'll get embroiled in these flat, fast exchanges, yes. which I think will suit the Chinese players better. Definitely. seen anything like it and the lift was actually good <laughs> look at that that's outrageous wow that's a powerful smash 
10, 9. Very deep, the lift had it, and then it invited a hard smash, but it was powerful. Yeah, the Danes have to look for these softer shots, mid court areas, <laughs> blocking it, making sure that they're not going into these fast exchange exchanges because the Chinese are really good at that. Yeah. <laughs> What a rally. Yeah. Two point advantage on a run of four straight points, and they go to the mid game interval. 11 9 in the lead. Three times All England champion, Chang Jun, the coach there. For the Danes. Eller så er der spillet lige nok, det skal være. Men der, hvis du finder, at det er for at det bedre ind mod midten. 20 seconds! 20 seconds! Så den meget tilbage over. Hey, vi har det rigtige spil. Ja, har vi det. Did you manage to catch any of that, Morten? Yeah. Um, Kenneth wants uh, Matthias to block more to the centre because he wants, you know, to cut down on the angles. You know, more block shots, but it doesn't matter you know how you place it but maybe even at the middle will be quite good just to cut that down on, on the angles service over but they're happy they're happy with how it's going they feel they have the right game they feel Eleven. they're they're up there matching the chinese and uh, things are going well Off the frame. <laughs> Ended up very effective. 12, 11. Well, they all count. But the idea was good. He, was, he, he is really pumped up. You can see it. But he is enjoying it, which is the main thing. Oh, look at that. But it's out. It's out. 13, 11. Yes. Are close to the maximum points they've got yes. in the game. Get ready, Chris. Isn't it 15 in one of the other two matches? Yes, both of the other two matches. Yeah. It's interesting to hear how the stadium is coming alive. Yes. <laughs> supporters from Denmark, supporters for China. As you said yesterday, a lot of Danish people are traveling over for this week of uh, Wimbledon. Oh, Wimbledon, all England. <laughs> I must be getting tired. So yes. <laughs> Every year, so many 
people are travelling over 12. to enjoy this wonderful week in Birmingham. Yeah, and the Denmark supporters, they all come in in uniform, don't they? They all Some have their, yes. their T-shirts mm. and... Service over. 13, 15. Is that the situation where Kenny wants them to maybe him to maybe block a little bit? I think so, yes. Yeah. A little bit too eager. Oh. Service over. 16, 13. Placement of the smash over. from yeah. Cheng Shi Wei. Yeah, that's very clever. The first 14, smash 16. was good, but this one here completely getting Christina on the wrong side. Well played by Si Wei. of the defensive shot there. 17, 14. And it skimmed over the net, didn't it? Mm. Lovely right. shot. Right. It's a missed opportunity. 15, However, I think 17. the Danes have been very successful keeping Huang Yachong out of the game. She's not been that dominant at the net. No. She's not been scoring as what we've seen in so many other matches already. She she is really, you know, they are really taking it to her and challenging her and putting on the, a lot over. of pressure. Fifteen. Three points advantage and three points away from this opening game. Position. It was a huge smash 19, from Christy Anson. 15. Good placement, too. Great piece. Oh. 
17-19. So now it's all about keeping their cool, if you look at it from a Danish perspective. 19-15 up, and now only 19-17. Perhaps even a block on this one. Rather than go into this fast ex exchange. 18-19. Who can hold their nerve? The Chinese are really showing class. Never give up. That's what I meant. Slow is over. Yeah. So two game point opportunities game point, for Christiansen and Pedersen. an opening game just under 20 minutes Flora Abate and the Afais the simple the there may be the Vimea Yeti the the Vimea Vajer in where we spill a ball in hand but at every time we have set fart in if we don't have a full swing so we do it so we can with the wind so they get it here the Vimea Lick and scoop them in the head they grip them good in Trykker og så sætter vi os ned. Fly, centrer, centrer, centrer ind mod den midt der, ikke også? Og hvis du har trykket, og du kan mærke den over mod deres forbundsjøn. Ja, jeg når ikke på den der træer der. Nej, men, men bare tænk, tænk det, når du trykker, fordi han kommer ja. mange gange tilbage. Altså, Chris, hun skal nok tage på den ud. Svipper Jonasson was pretty happy with things so far, but he was very, anything, very happy. Anything new to add to? No, they, oh. they want to keep doing the same. So block some, block to the centre. Um, love. But I think one thing is that they are very aware that the Chinese combination is possibly going to attack all out. Yeah. Which means that you know they've got to be prepared. But otherwise, just happiness Two. and smiles all no. over. Yeah. Play. 
ça. The Danish fans in their regulation t shirts. One, <laughs> three. Yes. We're just showing unity here. Yeah. No, it's good. There they are. Service mm. <laughs> over. We actually have One. a word for the supporters in Denmark. Yeah. You know, um, of course, it's, it's a widespread word called hooligans. <laughs> but we are the hooligans, and hooligans means that you are quiet, you are nice, you are polite. So we are the hooligans and not the hooligans. <laughs> <laughs> so wherever we go in the world, you know, supporting our teams and all that, we are always the hooligans. Five. One. Terrific dive, and it paid dividends. Thank you. Thank you. Christina managed Three, to close down the, the net, more or less. Yeah. The, the return shot was towards the net, but she was up there attacking it straight away and putting on some pressure, enough pressure. What a great serve. Oh. Yeah, she is serving well. Yeah, that's so a so better so smash from Cheng Su Wei. Three. Yeah, I think Steve Wei have played well. He has really stayed composed. However, I still think his partner, Ya Chong, is, is still lacking a little bit. She's not really into it, as we've seen previously. But maybe with a little bit of extra confidence here, a good lead, maybe we will see her coming back into full form. Service over. Four. Six. But just look at this, just look at this. Matthias is stressing her. Yeah. He is going in there, he's picking up the shuffle. He's ready, I'm ready. Five. You know, we can play. He is definitely stressing her. Five, six. Matthias, please stop going that this way. Stay on course, okay? A little moment of magic. What a defensive shot. Six. Oh. Absolutely brilliant. Yeah, that was good catching up. Yeah, all level. Six or eight. Yeah, he's picked up the shuttle again. Look at that. Yeah, I'm ready. And now he's got to stay Seven, within the court. Six. <laughs> Umpire told him not to wander off. Yeah. Four straight points. Oh! Service over. Seven. Oh. Why is 
difficult. Eight, yeah, I think, I don't seven. think he tripped or anything. Yeah. I think he just went down on his haunches and lost his balance, yes. Uh, he wanted to defend it in case it was oh, coming, God, but he lost his balance. Eight, seven. Is that one service error a piece now? Oh, I can't remember. But there's definitely cause for concern at the bench of uh, the Chinese coaching camp. It is indeed one service error a piece. Service over. Mm, Nine, she knows that's eight. a missed yes. opportunity. Yes. She is not happy. Opportunity was there, play that block shot, yes. turn it around. Nine, oh. One. Yeah, that one. One and good. some of what we normally see from her. Really charging it in at the net. Wang Yajong. This is how we normally see her. Phenomenal rallies. The reaction speed is just incredible. Two point advantage for Xing Chi Wei and Wang Ya Xiong here in the second. What you're nodding your head in approval of what's been said there. I, yeah, I had a, a small chuckle here because Kenny was saying, don't go for the money shot Matthias. to Matthias, which means that, you know, don't go for the flesh, the, the first one. You know, keep it cool, keep it calm. Yeah. Which is what you've been advocating. Sometimes you can be so fired up, you just don't think clearly, do you? Yes, yeah, it's all become a blur. Yeah. Uh, I have a good friend 
has said about badminton, which I think is very 13, correct, that you have nine. to have extremely fast and speedy legs, a steady hand and a cool head. Yeah. And get those three things to work together all the time. That's yeah. the trick. Yeah. Service over. Ten, thirteen. Service over, 14, 10. Yeah, that's what we're used to seeing. Yeah, finish them up, but then it's... 15, yeah. 10. But it was a good flick serve. I would, landed in. I would challenge think? it too. Yeah. I'm not saying that it's it is out, but I would challenge it. It's yeah. very, very close. And it's the first challenge of this whole semi-final. Yeah, it was close, but it was out. Correction out. So it was a it was a good challenge. Mm. Service over. 11-15. Play. The Danes. What would Matthias we do without that system? <laughs> Called in. Yeah, and of course, because they were right on the last challenge. They and they will be right, and they will be right on this one as well. You thought that was out as well? That's out as well. Wow. Correction. Who needs Hawkeye when you've got Eagle Eye Morton? <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> no, but I was Why pretty sure. 12, the 15. way I saw it, plus his reaction, I was yes. pretty sure. Yeah, because yes. he was right there, and, and um, they were celebrating, then yeah. the call came, and the so they immediately... They knew it, they knew it. Yeah, and when I said it was a good rally, it was also the longest rally. Two challenges in the last two Five. rallies. Both successful by the Danes. You don't do that. You will be punished. But it all came about by the good serve. Yes, 13, it was a very good serve. 15. So now the Danes are back to stressing the uh, the opponents, I think. They're yeah. Going back into that mode. Service over. 16-13. Clever. <laughs> Could you hear Christina? Ah. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> she couldn't get to it. 17, Very well disguised. 13. Perfect shot. Doesn't get better than that. Yeah. Look where it lands so far in front of that front service line, an indication of just how accurate that was. Oh, yes. Pure instinctive defence there. away now from the second game and levelling this semi-final one game apiece another three setter so it's a very exciting evening service over 14 19 That was a nice disguise shot. Good return of serve. Service over. She's played herself into the match. She she's has. making a big difference now. She does. Oh, yeah, she on. Game point opportunities. Only oh, needed the one. Twenty one fourteen second game to Sheng Chi Wei and Wang Yashiong. And Wang Yashiong, 21 game all 14. In this semi final. One game 40 minutes into the match. Men, men det er mere for, at det kan godt være, at det føles behageligt, at vi spiller lidt safe derop, men vi spiller faktisk ind på deres parametre. Okay, så må vi hellere lave en fejl, hvor vi, hvor vi går, altså ikke går og går efter dem, men hvor vi trykker lidt hårdere, end vi normalt gør. Okay. Herovre, hvis vi kan, så skal vi stadigvæk have trykket så langt af. Okay. Men det må ikke være blød af, så vil jeg hellere have, at vi trykker tilbage, og så står jeg endnu en gang. Okay. I spil kan vi få ind mod midten, så er det stadigvæk det er klart. Det kommer begge to lidt til ud fra vores form og tryk med hans baggrund. Ja. Det ligger sgu godt ja. men det er ikke vores fordel. Det er ikke vores fordel, nej. Heller sig, vi kan få ind Og så skal vi bare lige huske, at hun ligger på den her hele tiden. Så hellere spille midten. Vi skal holde ham fint i det. Ja, men det er stadig ikke Ja. Spiller du den bløde? Ja. Og så går du bare på toren. Ikke i tvivl om det. 20 seconds. 20 seconds. Vi vil med 20 20 seconds. Seconds. Well, something obviously by his gestures about the backhand and getting rackets up ready. What, what actually was he saying? Um, they feel that they are playing a little bit too much into the hands of the Chinese at the moment. They control a bit too much. Secondly, it's um, Ya Chong. It's, she's always covering that, you know, overhead on, on the backhand side, and they have to get out of that. Secondly, or thirdly, they, they have a tendency to push down to Siwei's uh, backhand side, and it, it looks like a good shot, but they always get in trouble from there. Right. One, love. Two, love. 
Oh, and decision there from Cheng Si Wei. Three, love. Oh, and this is a good start by the Danes to this third and deciding game. Good reactions. One, three. This one here. That's amazing. that has no right to play at all. And he keeps it in nicely. It's amazing. Christina, she got a bit caught there on the serve and then had to throw herself forward and that was also quite uncomfortable and she made the mistake so a lot of pressure on that situation there. Really pounced on that low serve, Matthias Christiansen. Good pressure. So good, and then talked about it in the intervals, and still Five, tempted to play oh. it. They should not play it. Wang Yachong tried to have a look at this one. Look at this one. She's so quick. His second service Six, error. Five. And it just clips the top of the tape. Oh, it's long. It's, it's long. long. Yeah, I thought it was going staying in. Seven, 
five. And there was well left. That's the nice little block there. Yeah. That's exactly what gives the control. Pushing the mid court so area from Pedersen. That Eight, one there. Six. Quickly, quickly, quickly. Just sit down. Quick tower long way. Quick tower. I know. Quick tower long way. No. Thank you. You hear me? The Danes to have a drink. They were only allowed to towel down, and Cheng Siwei went off and had a quick drink while the umpire was looking at the Danes. <laughs> a little bit cheeky, wasn't it? Yes. Nine, six. They put a lot of pressure on. Uh, Yaqing on that service situation. They flick quite a lot to her, and she is under pressure. turn of serve because I was going to ask the question would she have been better to let it go through to her partner but I think it that's precisely why it's such a good return because it puts opponents in a quandary mm. but she should have left it she should have trusted the partner right the yeah. service over yeah. 10 7 in this in deciding total. game, the Danes with Change a four-point advantage. 11-7. 52 minutes into the match. So who's going to be here over? Come on, he's sick of me with my bow. We got it knocked to the same. Let him win an angle, he can try. Do spiller. Yeah, he's going to be in this. He's going to be in Så må vi gerne have en enkelt swipper mod hende, hvis vi kommer i ulige i side, ned i hendes forhånd. Altid swip til hendes forhånd. Ja, ned i midten. Okay, det eneste vi kan styre her, det er pauserne mellem vores dueller, så vi er klar på, hvad det er, vi skal gøre. Vi skal slås. Laver vi en for... Vi skal ikke spille forsigtigt. Okay. Okay. So what did the Danish coach of the year? Wonderful award that he won at the end of last year. It was. Yeah, what award was he saying now? Dare to win. Dare to win. He who dares wins. Mm, dare to win. Flick to um, her forehand um, on a few occasions. So it's just simply dare to win. Don't be scared. Christina forward. Take the chances. Play the shots. Service over. Good round. 
8, 11. Christina, Matthias. Looked a nervous shot to me. It was very ambitious. And 12, yes, I think you're right. He is nervous. Eight. Pressure's on. Got severely 13, punished. Nine. Well, they're all being set up with that net cord on the return of serve. It's out. Service over. But I think you're right then. The fact Ten, that Seaway uh, might be nervous. Um, if we yeah. look at tomorrow Would finals, you? if the Chinese combination is not winning this one, China is only. Inverted commas, having the men singles, it's, a, it's the men singles, the two Chinese players in. But that's the two only entries in tomorrow's finals they will have then. Oh. And Japan, definitely 11, three 13. finalists and possibly four. They're involved in our last semi-final of the day. Exactly. Just two points in it. Clever smash. Aimed slightly across the body towards the right hip of Christina Pedersen. Look at this pinpoint accuracy. That's perfect. So just one point in it now. Exchanges. Absolutely amazing. Oh. 
I think the interesting thing is that the Chinese have sort of lost the communication. I don't know if you noticed that they're not really yeah. talking together how to solve the situation. Service over. 13, 15. Now, normally, I don't think Cheng Chi Wei would make an error on that. 16, that is another sign 13. of nerves to me. Yeah, but again, it's a clever return because yeah. he's cutting down the angles, what he can play. But yes, I think you're right, he is nervous. A lot of the nation pride is riding on his back. From Wang Yashian. Service over. Yes. Casino, who's your pick? 14, 16. The chest, you to receive. Play. Both at Christina Pedersen. On court, Matthias. Matthias, on court. Umpires having a tough time controlling the players. They're all over the place. 15-16. <laughs> <laughs> Keep their noses in front. Seventeen fifteen. Once again, a good return, but once again, it's a shot I would have expected this man to make. combination can't get out of the service situation at the moment the Danes are really adding on a lot of pressure 18 16 and this Quickly. is where the, the flick service coming into the situation because One, the Danes they're just rushing whatever low service coming they're really going for it and that's where the flick serve might be a very helpful tool Sixteen, play. Shot there from Christiansen. Played them into trouble that one. 17, Simply wasn't good 18. enough. 
Uh, Christina was shouting, come on, come on, it's yours, it's yours, it's yours, I can't take it. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. No. But yes, we turn it. No. No, we turn it. We turn it. So one point in it, 17 18. Here's a good flick serve. Yeah. That's what you were talking about. Yes. another one that might have been better to go through to Matthias but we can all be wise after the event Eighteen. Oh. Yeah, this one. Yes. change it change it yes it's it. well, the shuttle has been changed this time 18 or... A lot more doubtful. You see that Pedersen yeah. challenges? That no. is close. In. First challenge of this deciding game. Yeah, caught the line. Challenge and successful. So for the first time in this 19, deciding game, 18. the Chinese combination of Chen Siwei and Wang Yaxiong go into the lead. Christina, please. We play, we play, we play. The psychology of sport. One pair wants the shuttle change, the other pair say no. Opportunities. forward in court having been stuck at the back 19 20 and one match point has come and gone another oh. one remains for the Chinese pair and one of the best servers in the game is going to serve this one in the deciding game. A match lasting an hour and eight minutes. And 
for the Chinese pair a sixth final in six tournaments since they formed their partnership. For Cheng Si Wei, tomorrow he will contest his 12th straight Match mixed doubles Wei. final. 12 tournaments, 12 18, finals with two uh, different 14, partners. That is simply 19. remarkable. Well, what a thrilling semi-final it was. They had to come back from a four-point deficit at the change of ends in this deciding game. What a thriller. And what a victory for Cheng Siwei and Wang Yaxiong. 18-21, 21-14, 21-18 in the deciding game in an hour and eight minutes. Oh, great victory.